Hey friends, in this video I will guide you how we can export all Active Directory groups and their memberships as per their SAM account name. So what we need to do, we, we need to just uh, open the PowerShell through the PowerShell ISC. This is the PowerShell ISC which I am using to execute the PowerShell command as well as also to edit the po existing PowerShell. So we have just created a PowerShell script for uh, uh, for exporting the group membership uh, through the PowerShell so just I am going to open this PowerShell now you can see uh, this is the PowerShell command if you are using this PowerShell script on the domain controller so you don't require to write this uh, line import test module active directory but if you are just executing this PowerShell on any member server of Active Directory so you have to uh, put this uh, import dash module and Active Directory after that I am using a variable that is date and in this variable I am calling the current date when you are executing this PowerShell after that uh, I am using a variable that is group list in this group list I am just calling the get a dash ad group filter short name select name this is the uh, this is the uh, active directory powershell command um, that is used to uh, fetch the group name after that i am just using a write output ad group name and add user sam account name because i am just going to export the groups from active directory so i am just putting a a tab that is ad group name and after that uh, in the second column I am calling ad user sam account name and uh, through this write output I am just exporting these two value in a file that is uh, ad group membership dash date so uh, this file will be created as per the current date through this variable over here and uh, this will be saved inside the C colon AD underscore script. You can change the path uh, for the output as per your requirement. And I am exporting this variable value, uh, I mean file name as a CSV. So this is the dot CSV extension. After that, I am using a for each loop. And in this loop, I am just calling a variable that is dollar group in group list. So group list this variable is called over here and after that I am using a variable that is member list and in this member list I am again executing a PowerShell Active Directory PowerShell command that is get dash ad group member identity and group name select SAM account name now again I am using a for each loop in this for each loop I am calling member variable and uh, in the in member variable will take the value from the member list so I am just using in space dollar member list and then I am using write output group name member dot sam account name here this will create a file csv file where group name will be written in the bottom and um, member dot sam account name means all the members who are the part of any group that will be called over here and this will be written inside the C colon AD script and AD group membership dash date CSV. So first this will create a file in this file this will create a column AD group name and AD user SAM account name and this output will just write the value in, uh, in both column first name first is the AD group name and second is the SAM account name. Suppose if you have a group like uh, uh, ITRW, so in the first column it will write the ITRW and uh, here it will it will write the uh, AD group name and SAM account name. So I'm just going to execute this PowerShell script and we'll see how the result or output will come. So I'm going to execute it now we'll go on the csv file which has been created on this path so what i will go uh, i will click over here 
this is the file name which has been created and uh, if you want to open in excel file so what you will go you can open it as per your excel applications currently i am using libre office so i will click on the ok now you can see uh, this is the group name uh, domain users and account name so all users who are the part of any group suppose it team rw so it team rw is a group which exists in my active directory and you can see the members these are the members there are the four uh, four members are uh, added inside this it rw group so i will see one two three four so test dot two dot user this is the same account name of this uh, uh, this account this uh, membership so we'll go and we'll see the same account name of any user and we'll go in the attributes and here you can type same account name this is the same account name test one similarly if you want to verify like test so every account having a, a unique same account name test dash user one and you can go on this file so this is the same account name which is the part of this itrw group so this is the way which you can follow to create your uh, uh, powershell script to exporting all groups and their members uh, uh, in a single uh, script and uh, you can export it inside any csv file or xls file as per the extensions which you will specify while creating your uh, powershell script thank you for watching this video